folks. Archer Moreland. We got pre-owned deals that'll knock you off your feet. Tell them about it, Jeff. Over 50 cars for $1.99 a month. That's $1.99 a month. Check us out, folks. 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Over 400 pre-owned cars at MorelandGM.com. That's MorelandGM.com. And if Moreland's done on the back of your car, you pay too much. Good morning. Welcome back once again to the Statesman News Network. My name is Corey Knowles, and today is Thursday, April 28th. Uh, little news. Wreck Wednesday afternoon at US 60 and Route FF near Essex left six people injured, one of them seriously. According to Highway Patrol, 78-year-old Leroy Mims of Essex was northbound on FF and pulled into the path of a vehicle driven by Ricardo Carmona, 50, of Clarkton. The wreck occurred at 3.35 p.m. and several ambulances were sent to the scene. Mims sustained moderate injuries, the patrol said, and was taken by ambulance to Missouri Southern Healthcare in Dexter. There's a little more in-depth story talks more about what happened on the paper. Also, we've got uh, the uh, Honor Tour in Dexter. Uh, they're going to depart Friday from the Bearcat Events Center following a Royal Community Send-Off Ceremony. The group of 30 World War II veterans will then depart for a three-day Washington, D.C. trip where they will, among, men, among many other activities, see the World War II memorial that was built in their honor in 2004. At 7 a.m. Friday, a bus will leave Poplar Bluff headed for Dexter with several veterans already on board. The bus will be escorted by the Highway Patrol on their entire route to Dexter. And at approximately 7.20, it's expected to be at Highway 60 at ZZ, uh, where Dexter police will then pick up the escort and bring them into town. They plan to be, the first Dexter exit, be at the first Dexter exit moments later and travel east down Business 60 to One Mile Road. They will then turn south and travel to Grant Street, concluding at the Bearcat Event Center on Dexter's Grant Street campus, where there will be a ceremony held. Uh, weather, looking good. Today's going to have a high of about 70, a little around 48, and get ready for it. It's going to be sunny. It's about time. Uh, we're going to have some, hopefully, start to dry out a little and recoup before we get more rain this weekend. Uh, I don't think this weekend's looking to be a big washout quite like what we've been dealing with, but uh, right now any rain matters, and hopefully we'll dry out enough that that won't affect us too bad. Uh, that's about it for today. I'd like to thank everyone for tuning in to watch the Statesman Newscast. If you have any questions or comments, feel free to send me an email at cnoles at dailystatesman.com or give me a call at 624-4545. Don't forget to pick up a copy of the print edition for the stories we've talked about today and a whole lot more. And on that note, I will see you back here on Friday. Thanks for watching.